So now let's say you have a storefront that you want to open, um, let's say Monday through Saturday at 6.30 to 7.30 p.m. Or maybe you have an automation that you want to, you want to fire from Monday to Saturday. You want, pretty much you want something to happen um, on automation. Just no input from anybody, just... You just kind of set it and every day the automation will come in and it will do what it's supposed to do. So what you want to do is you want to create what's called a block time. Because the alternative is you can go in and set it for every day. So go in and set Monday, you want it to open at this time and you want it to close at this time. So you... That's, that's time consuming, but you can just create what's called a block time. To create a block time, you press set. Keep going until you see uh, block, enter to set block, and then press enter. So right now it's showing you what's, cur what's the current block time. So since we're looking for Monday through Friday, well, Monday through Saturday, so go ahead and press enter. The little cursor is going to go into Friday. Now you can um, change it to whatever day you want. Um, in this case, we're going to do Saturday. Uh, once you pick the day, hit enter. It's going to go down to the daylight saving time. Yes, we want that. And then hit enter to save it. All right. So you just created the block time, but you haven't done anything with it. So now you have to use it, apply it to something. So then we're going to create an event and we're going to apply the block to that event. Um, so, you know, just keep pressing set until you see event. Hit enter. So zero one is where we're going to store the first event. Um, hit enter. Hit enter again. Now it's going to now it's the cursor is under on so you can turn it off you can make the relay off or you can make the relay on so when the relay is on that's when your automation is going to happen uh, when the relay is off that means the the relay went back to a normal state your automation is most likely not happening depending on what you what you have going on so in this case we want the relay on and hit enter all right. Normally, it's not gonna the block is not gonna be the first thing that it's on. Um, you probably when you first come is gonna be on Monday, but you want block, so you're gonna keep going until until you get to block. So this is your block from Monday through Saturday, and now you want to tell it what time you want the block to execute this event. All right. Um, so in this case, we're going to do 6.30. So we don't need to change anything here. Um, so the next event is when it goes off. So we want to be in number two. Um, press enter again. It's gonna take you to off, so we're gonna leave it at off. And hit enter. Yes, we want we want to use the block time. We don't want a random day. And let's say we want it to stop at eight o'clock. Let's go ahead and change this to twenty. And let's make this zero. All right, so then just hit enter. And that's it.